We're getting down to the nitty gritty of September powered by Adidas Originals. We've had so many of you guys asking how you can catch up to those super hot steppers at the top. So I'm here to give you the insider tips on how to win. Make sure you stick around to unlock the knowledge. My first tip is to get as many boost steps as possible and to keep your GPS on for aglet at all times. This may be obvious to a lot of you, but it might be tempting for some of you to sit in front of the TV and shake your phone for 30 minutes. Those who do this may feel like they're super sneaky hackers who've broken the system, but it's honestly so much easier to just go for a three minute walk down the street to earn the same amount of aglet as sitting in front of the TV for 30 minutes, shaking away your phone. Boost steps earn you 10 times as much aglet per step, plus your arm won't ache and your account won't be flagged for suspicious activity. Also, when you're walking about inside, your GPS sometimes bounces and earns you boosted steps. So keep your GPS on at all times. You've got to play smarter for a better chance at winning. Next up, I think it's really important for you to know how aglet is earned. Here's the basics to get you up to speed. Imagine the area of this triangle is all the aglet a given shoe can earn you. As you wear the shoe and the durability goes down, so does the amount of aglet you earn with every step you take. Here's where you can use this knowledge to big brain September. You see, September is an aglet earning competition, not an aglet profit competition. If you want to win, you might want to take an L in the short term if your balance allows for it. Using the triangle knowledge, you know that a shoe is at its best when it's at 100% condition. If you wear a shoe down to 80% then switch to a new one, you're constantly earning at near peak potential. If you want to take this to the extreme, you could consistently be buying and switching to new sneakers as you go down to 99% condition as you walk. But I'd probably recommend not doing this if you enjoy not plummeting into bankruptcy. I'm just letting you know that it's an option. Also, it may be worth wearing the Gold Aglet NMDS1 during September if you're serious about winning prizes. Now, the competition can definitely be won using the RAS ones, but the GAS one is slightly better and therefore makes earning aglet just a little bit easier for you. So maybe you should consider offloading some of your sneakers on the marketplace for some GA or just purchasing some to have an easier time catching up to the guys at the top or dominating the upcoming weekly leaderboards. And finally, make sure you hit your aglet stashes on the daily. Your first three aglet stashes of each day count towards your total amount earned on the September leaderboard. And these can really be the difference between positions on the leaderboard, especially if you hit a rarer stash like a 10K. There's all my tips for helping you to win this year's September powered by Adidas Originals. As a past winner myself in 2020, I know how much work goes into winning this competition. If you truly want it, you can do it. Just don't cheat because you will get caught and you'll lose your account and everything that's on your shelf. That's all, and I'll see you in a bit. Peace.